Okay, this is a John Deere X540 54 uh, inch cut. I was wanting to uh, try to get a better configuration and possibly a rear lift system for it, so this was how my idea evolved. Um, I found a pretty good resitch adapter, which uh, I got at AutoZone for like $32. And standing on it, very, very strong. A lot of support, very rigid. So, my next idea was is that I was going to use that for my main hitch pin for my rear attachments. One rear attachment was going to be for my grass catcher uh, bags, for my bagger, leaf bagger, which uh, will be mounted to an upright stem. So this is, this is what I came up with. Uh, put some drawings on paper on the computer, on Microsoft Excel. I tried to follow those drawings as closely as possible. I knew with only that lower mount that I was going to need some sort of a weight transfer uh, point higher up. So this is what I did. Okay, so I figure what I'll end up doing is on this hinge piece here is I will use a uh, lineal actuator to raise and lower uh, for my uh, three-point hitch type configuration. I don't have any pins yet, so right now this becomes a bolt-on bolt application. This bracket originally that I'm bolting together was designed for my grass catcher. So I inverted it into a vertical position, welded my angle, uh, or excuse me, my square tubing onto this, and I'm going to take a, this is a two inch square tubing, I'm going to take an inch and a half square tubing, and I'm going to come up from there. That way I can universally mount from this hitch, leave it on permanently, and I can perma uh, mount my bags for my grass catcher. So. That's where I am so far.